Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here, and this is the start of Tier 10. Oh, we only have 36 Noble Nickels here? Do we have Noble Nickels in the Wily stage? Because we need... Do we need more than... No, we only need 36 Noble Nickels. We don't need 50. Okay, Tier 10, here we come. Ah, yes. This is like... This feels like Rainbow Road type of music. By Mr. Kiram. I, he was a judge in the first contest, wasn't he? Boil Man! I was gonna make my blood boil. We have five Noble Nickels to find. Let's get to it. Uh, tier 10. The best of the best here. Haha, <laughs> yo, what the... Normally, being so revolutionary, going left to start gives you free noble nickel or knee tank. Unfortunately... Uh-huh. Free bonus boss for fun. Meme injury. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's Airman. He's dabbing. Oh, hi there. Oh. His attacks are unique, but we don't have the best way of trying to damage him. And this other stuff is really going to work. Oh, this is cool. And he's giving up. Okay. Hello. I don't even need all this. And this will take us to the main stage. Okay. That's an interesting air man. I'm sure we're gonna contend with him again. Wonder what his actual weakness was, but um you know, Hornets worked pretty well, even though they didn't do extra damage. Oh, that's right. The wheel cutter doesn't like to work on those. Oh, whose idea was it to use these enemies? Oh yeah, Mr. Kiram's. Can I go down here? No, I can. And I have skipped part of this level. I cannot unskip that. Well, if there's a noble nickel on that path, we're gonna have to come back for it. Okay, so we have water. We have some fire enemies. Now we just need the boiling part to be happening. And we're gonna use the bubble mechanic, okay. I believe we hide something down here, don't we? Yes, we do. I should be watching this. Ooh. I'm gonna cheat a little bit here. There we go. I want to make sure we got that and didn't die. That is what utilities are for. Okay, we have the mine thing. We have... I don't know what I'm trying to do here with Slash Claw. I don't know what I'm trying to do here in general. Whoa. Okay, Bubbles, Bubbles, I would like you to appear on time. Oh my goodness. Uh, 
these things. Why am I still on wheel gutter? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm I'm getting boiling mad. There we go. I guess I have to ride this up. Oh yeah, those crab things. Those guys are a problem if you don't take them out quickly. They 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 have flamethrowers. Yes. Uh, they're boiling crabs. Uh, I can get this stuff out of here. And crabs falling from the ceiling. So we're boiling. I get why there's these crab and lobster enemies, because you put them in boiling water. Love it. Okay, Noble Nickel's got to be this way. Yes, it is. No, do not breathe your fire on me. Ah, uh, that one up there just kind of took off. <laughs> Probably not the best way to place him. Yeah, take that pot shot. Let's get rid of homeboy here. Let's actually use a weapon. You know, one of the three that I use continually. It works well. Oh, guys are a nuisance. Land into the water. How many of the noble nickels have I found? Uh, ouch. Have I found three or four or squids? Those squids are dangerous, from what I remember. Oh, they launch fireballs that are really obnoxious. I mean, they're dodgeable. I love the themes. I love the new enemies here. I can see why this made it to... Uh, Tier 10. Can I go down here again? It looks like I can because you have the background. Yeah, that is the hint. <gasps> oh. It's kind of a pretty vague hint, uh, your first time playing this. Remember, the reason I'm remembering some of this stuff is because I have watched Dr. Novocaine's Let's Play of this game. Granted, it's been a while, but I still do remember some things. Like where some noble nickels are hidden. That's a good challenge. Get Crabber Dabber Doo out of here. And let's ride this bubble up. Hi there, I will deal with you momentarily. Hey! I'm not supposed to throw another one that fast. I like those fireballs. They're they're dodgeable, but they're challenging at the same time. On a scale of one to ten. I don't really want to do this. <laughs> I feel these uh, these sections are just a bit too challenging. Oh, really? I'm way back here. Ooh. Oh, you're gonna lose some points for me on checkpointing. Because when you're going to have, I've said it so many times throughout this contest and Mega Man Maker in general, if you're going to have challenges that have a lot of instant death or where it's really likely that your player is going to succumb to the instant death, you need a checkpoint like immediately before and immediately after. Because having to repeat all of this stuff, especially when you have challenges where you're just waiting for bubbles to rise. It's just bad design. 
And yeah, that's it's putting a hamper for me on this. So for that reason, we are rush jetting through here because I don't want to replay, you know, two, three minutes of stage to get back to here to try again. I have a feeling I did not get all of the Noble Nichols. Well, this isn't suspicious and a half. I mean, it is suspicious, but... There was just a long wait there. <laughs> Very tricky. I like it. There's enough of a hint to make you suspect something is up. But then you just you have to be patient for it. Awesome design. Oh, hey, we do have a boil man. Let's, uh, well, let's see if we can just cut to the chase. Oh, we can cut to the chase. Um, I need, I need to work on this pattern here. Oh. Oh, that's right, he does the hopping. Okay, okay. He's gonna try and send me up there. Yeah, I remember Dr. Novocaine having some difficulty dodging him once he starts doing his air bouncing between the flames. Oh, we did find all the Noble Nichols first go. Awesome! Hey, I didn't have too much of a problem with the Picado 24s. I had more of a problem with it. it the the enemy I had more of a problem with was actually those squids that fire up and charge, because it just felt like, I mean, unless you're using a charge shot, you're not killing them in one hit. Or maybe a special weapon, but yeah, you guys know my feelings on the majority of the special weapons in this uh, game. Or I should say the special weapon combination, because that's really what I have the issue with. Yeah, I like I like the theme of the stage. I think it really felt like a boil man type of stage. The only stage gimmick I uh, had an issue with, again, that checkpointing and the um, and just that section in general, trying to jump across bubbles like that. That yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I decided to pass on that on the second go. I think how you dodge that triple plane for when he starts doing the triple jump, you have to get you have to get like between the flames, and then as he's jumping over, there's like a short period where you might be able to get behind him, or just get behind him the entire time. But for that, you'd have to be behind him to start with, which is really kind of hard to do. I don't know, I had an issue with the air capsule because the way its attacks are designed and the way he just floats in the air, it's not really conductive to uh, hitting him very well. You're waiting for bubbles to go up, and meanwhile his attacks will come down right on top of you. I mean, you might have like a quarter of a bubble of space to try and dodge around, on there. But yeah, either that or you use hornets. So I, yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of that airman battle. The squids either don't give them invincibility or just uh, don't give them invincibility and give them a little bit more health or only have them take one shot like the Picado 24s. I think the Noble Nickels were pretty decently hidden here, but there were subtle hints if you were looking for them.
Wasn't Mr. Kiram the same one that made the uh, Airman stage in the first uh, Make a Good Mega Man level? I feel like that was the case. No, I thought the level, the challenge was uh, pretty good, especially compared to the uh, Sheriff Man's level. But maybe this level was, again, a hair too long for what would be a normal Mega Man length stage. Um... But again, I have, I'm really nitpicking on that part. I'm reaching for something here. It's, you're, you're probably going to see that as we uh, go through uh, Tier 10. Always, always trying to do positives and negatives, but uh, not much stood out to me. But 39 out of 50. Whatever. He's not even a judge anymore. <laughs> yeah, that is kind of what it is. But I mean, you know, bubbles go up as, you know, you boil water, and it fits. Uh, really? I felt other custom bosses were far less dangerous than Boil Man. I, I find he's not threatening, but I died to him. <laughs> I what? Okay. Well, with that... Oh, and Airman is appropriately here. Oh, yeah. I'm sure. How do I... Oh, okay. This is how I... No, no. That's not where I... Okay, that, that's got to be the next stage. Uh, we're not going to start by reading the judge comments, and we're going to start getting into everyone's or the, the judge's favorite stages. I remember that stage. Yeah, that's it's a little bit of a doozy. Okay, I'm, I'm going to start on this side, and I will see you guys next time. Which Which one is first? The one over there or the one up there? Uh, we'll figure that out later.